Hey guys, it's TSI. Yes, I'm your buddy Taz, if you guys don't know who I am. But yes, guys, TSI, it means Twitch Sings Interviews. And now, what does that mean? I get to talk to people on Twitch Sings. And the reason why I keep on asking them is because I'm a really slow kid. I, sw I swear when it came down to it, guys, if you have problems learning stuff, trust me, I'm in the same boat as you guys. But no, but no, seriously, seriously. I we got to keep on refreshing ourselves. So, yeah, let's learn together, okay? Now we're going to be talking to our next guest. Timey Lives! How you doing? Hi, sweetie. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm, I'm doing good. great. Oh, wait. Where, where <laughs> are you coming from? Florida. Nice. Florida. Now, I, I'm outside. I stream outside. <laughs> yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm just mad that you got a pool. <laughs> well, it's hot here you know and um i have to jump in it sometimes in the summer because it's too hot yeah you know? but that sucks in canada because we're, cause we're still at the point of, it's too cold we're at I'm the so point so we're still getting snow so we're like oh damn it well i will tell you you can live vicariously through me it's okay <laughs> i can't get in the pool yet anyway it's too cold the water's ice cold yeah it's cold yeah oh so i was gonna ask you i was gonna ask you now we're talking about twitch things now can you explain to my audience what Twitching is? Uh, for those that don't know what it is, it is a it's a game, and it is sort of like a karaoke. Um, you it's free to play. You can download it, and you can play it either online or offline. You don't have to stream it. You can use an avatar if you prefer. If you're a little shy, camera shy, or have stage fright. Um, you can play with just your friends and just do, you can record it offline and just upload if you want to or not upload. Um, it's really, for me, it means a lot more, but it, it's a game and it's a lot of fun. And depending me, on oh, who, go ahead. Oh, uh, depending on who you're game with, or, or I'll say this for people that are first starting out, my word of advice would be join parties or duet with people because the fact is you're not alone then because i see people jumping in jumping in solos and then they have the avatars and then they make the big mistake because it's like the avatars are so bland and sometimes it's like when you're first starting out it's kind of like you don't want to sing solo i think it depends on the person okay. i think sometimes you can start out as a solo and build up to it if that's what your confidence needs um at the same time once you start duetting, your whole world opens up um, because that's when the community comes into play and that's how you get to know everybody. And the wonderful thing about the Twitch Things community is that they are very warm, welcoming. Um, no, but you're going to find that the majority of people are there to have fun. They're not there to judge you for how you sing. You know, you're perfect the way you are, however you are. Yeah. And we all started out somewhere, and I'll tell you what, the more you sing, the better you get, no matter who you are. Yeah, exactly. Now, I was just curious. Now, personally, personally, you, what is your, what is your, what is your type of favorite genre to sing on Twitch Sings? Mm. For you. I know. It's hard for me because I love to sing, period. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. My history is a bit complex when it comes to music and my ability to sing. Um, so for me, just singing is a joy. But if I have to choose, I'm going towards this jazzy, definitely jazzy um, or musical, you know. The crooner, jazz the old musical. jazzy. Yeah, yeah, nice. Yeah. Now, I yeah. know we... We know on the Twitch, we were in the Twitch community, so we uh, we know of the lingo. But yes, we call them features. Now, what things could they add to Twitch Sings to make it better, so we can figure these features and get rid of them slowly? I know it's an well, awesome game. It's an awesome game. It's but it is in certain parts of it are still in beta. Like the parties are still in beta. Yeah, and they just did an update. Um, for example, today and basically. What ha well yesterday, but I did. Basically, what happened was m all of my duets are so quiet you can barely hear them. Whoa! And I mean both sides, and but they found the problem, and they're working on them. And the, for me, the amazing thing is that how, 
how often do you get to have one on one FaceTime or if not FaceTime, um, like direct contact with the developers of a game so that if there's a problem, you report it to them immediately, they start action on it to fix. It. Yeah. I mean, how often does that happen? That, ha that doesn't happen that. very often. It doesn't. But it I can really I can doesn't. understand like they actually have you know uh, even Kiro he's actually explained to me like I told him a few of the a few of the bugs I would wish would we worked on but he said well he did mention that it takes a very long time to get all the rights and all the the work in there like sure they have thirty seven hundred songs but they don't have everything it's easier oh they can. I don't think they can. There's the the cost of it would be yeah. exorbitant, and the fact and, it's and a also free game. Yeah, and also the fact is they have to have they actually have to hire writers. They have to hire people that actually have the rights or whatnot. They have to hire like performers that way, to, you know, or to even get the rights. But the fact is, they're actually putting the time and effort to actually keep. I like how they keep it up to date. Like I love it. Like when they change. And they released the hard rock, uh, the hard rock featured playlist. Oh, they update and yeah. add more. I love they yeah. add more constantly. They're always doing that. They're taking they input from the, input added. from the community, and that thing yeah. is that is good on their part. I just wish oh, yeah. they make the av I wish they made the avatar avatars more customizable. Like, I'll say something like stupid, like Fortnite. You know, we it's need like, curlier hair. We need curly hair for God's sake. There's one curly hair out, but they got two now. There's two different curly hairs now. I, so, no, but that'd know. be cool if, if they actually, like, if you went into the hair or whatnot, and then they actually had, like, a, you know, they have, like, a toggle, or they actually have a switch where you can actually customize every detail. That'd be cool. And then everyone would be it a little bit different. It would be cool. But, again, free game, right? Free game. You can't really, you can't they really. Can only, you can't get everything in a free game. Yeah, That's how can. I see it. You can't. I think that, that it's important that they're focusing where they're focusing right now, yeah. which is doing everything they can to, because I was in, I started playing when the sec with the second beta. Yeah. Um, the, it opened up with beta and I got an email about it and I was at the time on YouTube full time. Yep. And I was like, mm, I'm singing on YouTube. I don't need to sing both places. I'll pass. And then I regretted it. And I was like, I want in. And it was too late. I was, oh. I was too late by two days. By two days. So I had to wait. And it wasn't that long. It was only two weeks. But I had to wait two weeks till I could get back in. So I was two weeks into the first beta. Sorry, there's a bug on me. It's okay. <laughs> yes, I those were out. They have the plenty of those in Florida. They have plenty of those in Florida. <laughs> Freaky bugs in Florida. I'm sorry, and they and they tend to bite me in weird spots. Like I have a bug bite on my neck right now, and uh, one bit me. I'm sorry. Okay. I would just hate getting <sighs> focus sitting right in my back. I can't reach back there. I hate that. I'm like, oh, Damn that's it. what I'm saying. I can feel it. I can feel it. Like it's back there, and and the one on my neck is horrible because you can't see it. Oh. You know, you can't see it. But you got to take care of it, right? Yeah, that's why yeah. I have the. Yeah, it's going on because they're <laughs> neck. You just have to, you just have to turn your you just gotta turn your head really really fast and just swat them with your hair. <laughs> that might work. Hey, that's what they do. That's what they do in Australia. They ha they wear those hats and then they have cork on it and then they swat their hat and then they swat them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just go. don't give yourself a head rush. That's all. I'm getting to see. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, there was a bug on me. I just got it off. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So, yeah. Now, um, now I'll just say, I'm going to put myself in the shoes of someone that I just signed up to Twitch Sings. I've been only on Twitch Sings for about, you know, three days. Now, what advice do you have for me? Oh, uh, have fun. Just have fun. Get to know people. Um, and if you are going live, don't ever announce it in somebody else's chat. That's a big no. That's, no that's rude. I, I see that rude. Yeah. People, well, it is, but people don't realize it. And that's the thing. Like, if you're brand new and you're coming in, and quite often when people come in, like, through Twitch Sings, they may not be streamers. They just may want to sing. You know what I mean? And they don't know that there's, like, what's the word? Etiquette? Yeah. And the etiquette is you don't, you, you don't talk about 
other people that are live when you're when you're in somebody's chat when they're live you don't mention the fact that you may be live when you don't ever go fishing for people because all it's going to do is turn people off you don't want to do that just get to know people just yeah. have a good time and they will come to you they will come and they will sing with you because whenever somebody new comes sing with everybody yeah, and just like etiquette. One of us. 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 <laughs> now, I have to say with etiquette, I find also with it, when you're in a party or whatnot, proper etiquette is I know you have to be respectful of the person singing, but also mute your mic because the fact is it oh, doesn't. That's the most important thing. Yeah, that doesn't, you know, because obviously the person singing up there, they might be new. They might be, you know, they might be experienced, but I'll say this, you know it's still, I'll say this. It's distracting. Like, it's distracting. And for all, and newer people, it's kind of, you know, it's tur it, it, it turns them off. Because if they hear the echo of how, oh, my gosh, how's that? I actually sound like that. You know what? But then every time they, every time the person uh, person's done in the rotation, you got to tell them, like, good job or whatnot. You're not there to say, oh, my God, you suck. We're not all pros. We're not supposed to be pros. We're just having fun. It's about having fun. Yeah. And, and the other thing is to... I think it's the person who's hosting the party's responsibility. When somebody new comes into a party, I let them know we mute, you know, as soon as the, as soon as the song, you could talk up to the moment the song starts, but the moment that song starts, hit mute and make sure you hit play to go ahead and start singing your song. Don't wait for us to shut up because we're not going to shut up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just... We'll shut up when you, when that song starts. That's how we know to shut up. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so make sure you mute. And if you have hand spasms, double check to make sure you haven't double clicked it like I do all the time. Oh, Oop. now now my question is, now how did you come up? I know it, there's, a, there's probably some, uh, there's a story about it, but I'll say this. How did you come up with Timey Lives? How did you come up with that? I was just curious how, how that name came across. Come on, you got to um, tell well, us. We got story time. Yay, story time. <laughs> I started out as, okay, first, I have to go back a little bit before I was anybody. I was okay, just okay, okay. I was, I have severe fibromyalgia. Oh, shit. And I was bed bound for five years. Um, the cold up north was very bad for me. I did nothing but curl in a ball and cry for five years, basically. Um, summers were a little better, but they were not, you know, it, my life was hell. And we moved and changed my treatment. And I found myself singing in my kitchen. And I was shocked because I hadn't sung in five years. And I had had friends that had pushed me up on stage drunk, you know, when I was healthy. <laughs> but I'd never... And I got addicted to karaoke back then, but we won't talk about that. We won't talk um, about that. That's another story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ask on her but... I dare you. <laughs> <laughs> when I realized it, I, I, I was sort of like, it was bittersweet because I was like, how can I share it? I'm still homebound. Well, I got on YouTube. I've been on YouTube for three years now. Yep. And I've been on Twitch for just over a year now, full time. All right. And, um, I love Doctor Who, so my full name is Aww. Timey Wimey Girl Sam. So if you know who Doctor Who is, then you know the reference. If not, Taz, do me a favor, right around here, just I'll send you the clip if you need it. Just input the little Timey Wimey thing here, okay? Yes, okay, <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> I will use and that to my best ability, and trust me, guys, I'll be using help. it for I'll be using it for bragging rights. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> and um, but I also six years ago now had breast cancer. Oh. And I had a double mastectomy, and that double mastectomy saved my life. Whoa. Yeah. Had I not had it, they found things in the final biopsy that I. I would have died in 2018. Yeah. And I it dawned on me January 1st of 2019. And when that happened, I changed my name to Timey Lives because I'm alive. Oh, that's great. That's great. Cuz I'll and say I this. Celebrate there's a lot of people everything. that there's a lot of, I have to say shout out to all those people that I know that Ashley that 
Because I could say that, like, my mom, like, she had liver cancer, but I'll say that. Like, cancer is something that we're all trying to fight. Like, it's a big boss that we can't beat. You know what? It takes all of us. And the fact is, it's awareness, too, because there's a lot of people that, you yeah. know, they think, oh, it can never happen to me. But no, it can, it happen, can happen to anyone. To anybody. anybody. And, and, yeah. And the fact is, it just you're... remember to support, support, do, do your, do a good turn and support the people that you know what that is uh, that have conquered it because the fact is they have fought a battle that you would not know what not know how to I even was, comprehend. I was blessed. Yeah. I was very blessed. I made I I kept everything. I was very clinical, which is not how do I put it. It's not that it's not like me, but when it comes to me and because of other things in my past, I don't. I'm like an open book. Nobody knew I had cancer. Yeah. My husband knew I had cancer. Yep. My kids did not know I had cancer. Oh, shit. I didn't tell anybody until I had made my decision to have the mis double mastectomy. Then my close family found out. Nobody else found out, so it was over and done with. Mm -hmm. Because I had just been through enough with the fibro, yep. and I did not want anybody else influencing my decision. Yeah. And I couldn't handle hearing, even with the best of intentions, I couldn't handle it. Oh, no, no. So, exactly. I did what I had to do, and I, in the end, it turned out I did the exact right thing because had I not done it, I would have died. So, yeah, yeah, exactly. You know? Well, thank you. Well, I'll just say, yes, Steve, Steve, stop it. Anyway, Steve is freaking biting out my heels. But yes, thank you. <laughs> thank you so <laughs> much for being a guest on the show. Thank you. My absolute pleasure. May I say one more thing? Okay, no problem. No problem. Steve, Sorry. you, you can you um, step, on, step on his tail right keep now. Keep doing. So. Yeah. Drink. Oh, it was about his tail. <laughs> Tickle it. He's dead. Tickle it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> he just wants attention. You know it. I know it. I have a 95 pound puppy here. <laughs> uh, uh. Um, I also started, I made a commitment to, I, found, I made a commitment to stream for a different charity every single month. Oh, cool. And I do a ton of research before I decide which charity yeah. it's going to be. This month, it's for the foundation, American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. Um, I use Charity Navigator to help uh, narrow down, you know, yeah. which ones are transparent and which ones the, the money's going where it's supposed to go and making the biggest difference. Mm -hmm. I also started a stream team. Oh. It's a charity stream team that is just, it's not like I'm not a I'm not a partner, so I can't have a stream team technically. Yeah, you know, technically by by paper you but can't have a stream. It's team. for charity. Yeah. It's for charity. So it's called Wild Ones Unite for Charity. And any streamer that is interested in joining is welcome to. No one's obligated to do what I do. Nobody's obligated to stream for any charity that I support each month. I change them up every month. But if there is one they're interested in and they want to, then I learned through Twitch Things community what a difference we can make. Yeah. We are, our community raised for Extra Life, the Children's Hospital Charity. Yep. yep. We are in the top 10 all time successful fundraisers in the history of Extra Life. Whoa. Twitch Things oh, is. That's, that's that amazing. And that showed, yeah, that showed me 100% when we work together. We can make a bigger difference. And um, every month I've been doing it, and the stream team is slowly growing, That's and cool. people are welcome to join. And if they would like to stream, they just let me know that they're interested in the charity of the month, what the, what they're gonna when they're going to be streaming. I, I put it on the calendar for the campaign and what their incentives are so people know, and we'll head on over there too. Awesome. Great. Yes, yes. Steve, yeah, I let him go. So I'll say this now. Thank you. Thank you so much for being on the show. Thank, thank you. you. I can't thank you enough. Thank you for having me. It's my absolute pleasure and honor. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. That's all the time we have today. But you know what, guys? Please leave me a like because I like bacon. You like bacon. We all like bacon. No, no. Guys, I know you can't leave Not me a comment, but tell me. Yeah, tell me. Tell me how I'm doing. You, you, can, you can actually email me at tazzle at gmail.com. Please, guys. Serious comments only. Come on. I got to learn how to get better. Come on. Girls like us are good skills. I need some skills. 
Trust me, my ex probably thinks so. But yes, I'll say this, guys. Please down, look down in the description below, and you'll definitely find Tyree Lives. Yes, you'll definitely find her. You'll definitely find her, her, her Twitch. And you know what? And do stop by, stop by, stop by what she's saying. And you know what? She might not just just be singing. She could be doing other stuff. Hey, who knows? Stop by her Twitch. Yes, guys. So, so guys, I'll see you guys in the next next video, guys. See you guys. Oh, <laughs> oh,